Another Baltimore sports hero in trouble with the law is apologizing. Olympic swimming icon Michael Phelps is waiting for a court date tonight after he was arrested for DUI and speeding. 11 News reporter George Lettuce has the story. Police tell us Phelps had just paid the toll at the plaza here on the north side of the Fort McHenry Tunnel. When an officer pulled him over a short time later, the officer said Phelps was drunk and at one point was going way over the speed limit. It's the third time in a decade Phelps has had to publicly apologize to his fans. Hours after his 1.40 a.m. arrest, Michael Phelps' 2014 Land Rover was still on the shoulder of I-95, just north of the Fort McHenry Tunnel, where a Maryland Transportation Authority police officer pulled him over for going 84 in a 45 and then crossing the double lines in the tunnel. He was also charged with DUI when police say he appeared to be drunk and then failed several field sobriety tests. His Land Rover stayed put while the most decorated Olympian of all time was taken to MDTA headquarters to be processed. And then he was released, which police say is normal, especially since Phelps' last DUI in Maryland was 10 years ago. No one answered the door at his Canton home. His neighbor, Floyd Keller, says the two are friends, but he has not seen or spoken to Phelps since the arrest. I know he's got to be hurt. You know, I, feel, I don't feel nothing but sorry for him. I mean, I know he's upset. And, you know, I'm sure his fans are, too, and people that know him. Phelps issued an apology on Twitter saying, quote, I understand the severity of my actions and take full responsibility. I know these words may not mean much right now, but I am deeply sorry to everyone I have let down. It's a familiar tone for Phelps, who in 2009 apologized after a photo of him smoking marijuana at a party was leaked. Five years later, another lack of judgment from the Baltimore sports hero, the latest one to do so in a city that's seen too many lately. I just think in light of what's going on in sports and all eyes on prominent athletes, it just he should have known better and at this stage in his life, he should have made better decisions. Police classified Phelps' arrest as a serious traffic offense, which means the 29-year-old training for another Olympics will at some point face a Baltimore City judge and a $290 fine for the speeding. And Phelps also faces a $70 fine for crossing the double line inside the tunnel, and it's at least a possibility he could face some prison time for the DUI charge. We're live in Southeast Baltimore, George Lettuce, WBAL, TV 11 News.